Hey guys, as we continue to talk about war, our focus is got to be on the right things. Got a minute? Sun Tzu says, Engage people with what they expect. It is what they are able to discern and confirms their projections. It settles them into predictable patterns of response, occupying their mind while you wait for an extraordinary moment that which they cannot anticipate. I see so much of the church waging war on things that in the grand scheme of things are not important. The devil is using something to get our attention while he does other things on this side. The Bible says this, In your anger do not sin. Do not let the sun go down while you are still angry. And do not give the devil a foothold. The reason he follows it up with and do not give the devil a foothold is because in our anger that we carry for extended periods of time for whatever it is, then that gives him the ability to direct our attention there while he takes care of us in a different way. While we're angry at people saying happy holidays and Starbucks cups and all kinds of silly things, the devil is painting Christians as angry groups of people. And that's not the message of Jesus. We live in a fallen, broken world, which means that there will always be things around us that are not right. And we have to learn how to shine God's light there. So reevaluate the things that make you angry. Ask yourself if somebody were to come up and they were to agree with the other side of your argument, they would be disagreeing with you. Would you be able to connect with them? Would you be able to show God's love to them? Because if your anger overruns your ability to show love, the love of God to the people around you, then you've missed the point Thanks for spending a minute.